let's start with simple selector because it is the first type of selector we are having simple selector is also once again internally having some sub parts what are they for using a simple selector you have to use one id class and one more thing that is that particular element what is the element you are using in html this is the thing what you need to do using a simple selector i am telling you once again id class and element let me take one example my desktop there is a particular css youtube yeah inside this one i am going to save simple dot html in the same html file i am going to write my simple selector related code i am going to take my template i don't want title in my body i am going to provide a element called as p this is one paragraph this is one paragraph this is one element and we are having one more element called as h1 heading element so what is the output we are going to get the default styling what my h1 and what my paragraph is having that is the result what i am going to see <coughs> That is the what I am going to see in my output heading element and this is one paragraph a paragraph element the background color is white and for this particular paragraph it is also white and the text coming in black color. If I want to change a particular elements information if I want to change a particular elements information we are going to use these selectors where I need to write my piece of code we need to write our css information inside an element called as style and it is having one attribute called as type without type attribute also your code will work the default from the html5 standard version you don't need to provide that type attribute from the all standard versions updated versions you don't need to provide this particular type attribute without this one also your code is going to execute style element for this style i am going to provide my css information what is the syntax we have to use the selector what type of element i want to apply for my paragraph i want to apply one type of styling so i am going to select my pay element for this thing i am going to use one property called as color we will discuss a little bit clearly about what are the values you are having for a particular color property in coming sessions but for now color means nothing but a particular information which you a particular element is carrying for that information you can change the color i am going to make this one to red color colon red i am going to select my paragraph and for my paragraph i am going to change the color that is the meaning of this one so let me refresh the page superb i successfully changed the color of my paragraph if i am having one more paragraph if i am having one more paragraph for that paragraph also i am going to get the same stylings what i am applying in my style element this means I am selecting all the P elements with the content water it is carrying all those elements are going to get the color as red that's the meaning of having a particular color property with value called as red right now you need to focus on the simple selector simple selector means you are going to select a particular element selecting html element that is the meaning of simple selector if you want to apply a color for your h1 you have to first of all select your h1 and you can give the color for your h1 to maroon or let's make this thing to yellow now your heading element is going to come in 
yellow color. If you want to provide a particular color for each and every element whatever your body is carrying. Let's assume you are having a particular element called as PRE. If you are having H2 element also. Heading to control S, click on cancel, Alt tap F5. What happened? Those two elements are going to come in normal format. But if you want to apply a particular color for each and every element, what are my body is carrying, then simply we can give, I'm deleting this one. We can select the body element. For that body element, I'm going to provide a color, color colon blue. Control S, Alt tab F5. Now it is not going to worry about what element my body is carrying. For all the elements, I'm going to give a simple and same color. This is the meaning of selecting a particular element and applying a styling to that particular element through using simple selector. Through using simple selector. Good. And in the next video, we are going to see about how to select a particular one element. I don't want to provide this particular coloring for a particular entire code what my body is carrying. I want to select and I want to give a color for only for my paragraph. I think we already done that one few seconds back. This is what I'm telling. This is not what I'm telling you. If I want to apply a color for my first paragraph, I can do. If I want to apply a color called as black for my second paragraph, I can give the separation. I can give the separation to each and every element also through using this selectors concept only. You can see that examples in the next video. I hope you understand. So for more other updates and for learning uh, very important topics like all these selectors and CSS very important things, please subscribe to our channel. I am sure you are not going to uh, feel burdened or you are not going to feel bad while you are learning these things. Have a great day.